What's up everybody, my name is Patrick at The Elect Pros and today I'm gonna to show you how to program an HD 7950. Uh, what I'm using is a Sapphire, as you can see I actually have it going already. Um, I'm gonna show you how to program the BIOS to actually work it with a Mac instead of having to buy the expensive Mac version. I think the Mac version goes for somewhere between $500 to $800. Uh, you can buy a $100 uh, HD 7950 or equivalent and you can flash it and make it work on a Mac. We'll show you how. We're gonna start with downloading ATI Flash. Uh, this is going to allow you to flash to your AMD card. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and get the latest one right here. Click download. Click your server. I've already downloaded it, so I have it right here. Um, and along with this page, it is a forum. Uh, someone actually made a Python script to modify the BIOS to be able to be flashed and used on Macs. Um, so this is for Python. So if you don't have a Mac, you're going to go ahead and go down here. Uh, this is the ROM that you're going to have to download. I've already downloaded as well. Um, this will just enable you to do it without actually having a Mac. This is our ATI flash. Um, once you go into the software you've downloaded, right click and hit run as administrator so you can access all the things it has to offer. Um, right here it'll list your graphics card. As we know we're dealing with the HD 7950 um, and this is going to show your current vBIOS. Uh, I've already flashed it to the one that I need, uh, the one that we've downloaded. Uh, if you haven't flashed it or done anything yet, hit save. Um, it'll bring up uh, the file thing and you just save that BIOS as a backup in case things go wrong. Um, after that, you're going to head to hit load image. You're going to load that one that we downloaded in that form and go ahead and hit program and it will take you through um, unfortunately I'm not going to be able to see the screen but I'm going to do it right here I'm going to load the one that oh there it is Mac 5950 ROM um, we loaded it as you can see it's the same exact one so for me it's not going to really change anything um, hit program it's going to flash it and says it's already installed. Um, it won't show this if you're currently doing it. After it's done, it'll ask you to restart. And the uh, it'll restart. It'll work just fine. Should work just fine in Windows. Um, but next, we'll move it over to the Mac. Okay, so now we've done that. Uh, I've reinstalled the Sapphire card and... Um, how we do that is it, this is the MacBook Pro uh, desktop and this doesn't work other than on these uh, luckily it already has the connectors we're gonna need uh, we've hooked everything in we are still on BIOS 2 where is that oh, BIOS 2 and now we're gonna just turn it on let me hear our fans kick on fans are going and then now hopefully we can get a picture out of this I'm using a projector because it makes it easy to work on things so hopefully by this point if you're in this video you can get this too the Apple logo and everything coming up Take your time. There it goes. Perfect. So now we know our video driver is working. And I can issue this computer back to the customer and he will be happy. Thanks guys for watching. And feel free to message or call or text me if you have any questions.